Hey, you guys, and welcome back to The Family Hustle. Today, we are gonna be talking about my very first passive income product. Now, what is a passive income product? Well, there's other, there's obviously, there's all sorts of ways to earn income, right? Which is exciting for me as an entrepreneur. Um, but a passive income product, in my opinion, is something that you do once, and then you can kind of set it and forget it. You can drive traffic to it, and it can generate income every single month. And so if you are just getting started, and you're thinking, ooh, I want to I want to figure out a way to make multiple streams of income. I want something that is, you know, maybe a set it and forget it, something that may be, you know, a daily, a weekly, a monthly way to make some extra money without that much effort, um, then this is something you might want to listen to. Hey, go getter I'm Angela. And I'm Adam. We help normal moms and dads chase after their big dreams. In a modern online world. All while in the midst of raising kids. <laughs> in what we call the family hustle. So my very first passive income product was actually an ebook that I wrote. Now, this is so interesting because I started as a blogger and I honestly didn't even know how I was going to make money online as a blogger. Um, I just knew I wanted to make money from home so that I could be a stay at home mom. I had a passion for health and wellness. So I had my blog. That's what my topic was. That was my niche. That's what I was going to share about was natural health topics that moms would be interested in this was this was just me sharing what i was passionate about i didn't even think about all of the like branding stuff this was just me being me and talking about what i was interested in and what i like to you know share about um and then i was added to all these different blogging networks and natural health blogging networks and i got connected to other women who were earning an income through their blog and so they started sharing some different ways that they earn income they talked about um, affiliate uh, products selling affiliate products which is definitely a way that you can earn extra income if you haven't grabbed my 22 ways to grab extra income every single month it's a freebie I will put it in the show notes so that you can grab that and I will talk more about affiliates but this is something I wanted to talk about today passive income through an ebook now you can actually use an ebook as a lead generation so this would be something that you would give away for free or nearly free because I know I've, I've listened to Shailene Johnson and she talks about, you know, if you want people to actually use what you've written, what you've done, you might want to charge a little bit, like $3, $7, because they're more likely to get it and read it if they paid for it. And that's something that I've actually learned the longer that I've been doing this is that sometimes free is not the best if you actually want somebody to use what you're creating because if it's free they'll blow it off but if they paid for it they'll pay attention so even if it's like i said under nine dollars um then it's a very small investment for them but this is how I started making extra money through my blog was through an ebook that was I think it was maybe you know three dollars six dollars it was definitely less than nine dollars and it's a way for you to um, have almost like an impulse buy people who you're they're interested in something that you can help them with but um, and like I said this ebook I wrote mine in canva.com, so I saved it as a PDF. It looks very pretty. You know, it, it doesn't have to be 100 pages. Usually an ebook is something that's easy to digest, but solves a specific problem. So my first one was how to manage gestational diabetes naturally, because that's what a lot of people were asking me about. I actually started my blog because I had dealt with gestational diabetes, and I was a healthy mom, and I was like, how in the world did this happen? Happen and I changed the way I ate because of it and I learned a lot about nutrition and it was just like I want to share with this because I know I cannot be the only person who has had a shocking gestational diabetes diagnosis and so I wrote my ebook and I I still sell that ebook every single week um, Another thing some people ask me about is how I actually swayed for a girl. Um, my first two pregnancies, we um, because I have a, um, a genetic uh, disease that I'm a carrier of, I wanted to maybe boost my uh, odds to conceiving a girl. And so I actually wrote an ebook for two different sways that I did and actually conceived girls because of doing certain things. And so um, that's another book that I sell a lot 
of every single month because people who are like me, who are like, if I could help my odds uh, naturally, then I would like to do that. And so that's another ebook. So think about um, what is something that people ask you about or something that you know just a little bit about that you could craft an ebook and put it together put your name on it. You know, this is yours. A hundred percent of the profit is yours. That's one thing that I like about eBooks affiliates. You're only getting a portion, you know, sometimes it's only, you know, 10%, a really good affiliate is, you know, 40%, which that's kind of rare. A lot of them are 20% and below. Um, and it's, you know, and so that's something that you have to consider. Although that's definitely a way to make extra money online. I personally have you know, some affiliates. I have residual income through my network marketing company, and then I do eBooks. Um, all of this is online, which is what I want to help you do is build an income online. And I love talking about multiple streams of income. Um, and so let's think about if you add somebody into your community, into your realm of genius through an eBook, and then they're like, wow, she, I like, I like what she has to offer. What else does she do? It could be the gateway to them falling in love with you as well. And so sometimes an ebook is like the first yes, because sometimes it's hard to go from like, you know, um, a $200 course, but then they, they might buy an ebook first that's $7 that helps them solve a specific problem. And then they're like, oh man, she was so helpful with this. What else can she do? So think about that. Think about how can you can, how can maybe an ebook be the first step to working with you, a low entry price, $9 or less. Um, and then you can have offers that you can continue to offer them that helps them continue on the journey, uh, getting results, working with you, um, and then increase, you know, a $37 offer, a $40, $7 offer, a $297 offer, a $2,099, you know, offer. So think about what is the first thing you could do? One specific problem um, that you could help them solve and then you can turn it into an ebook. Like I said, I designed my ebook on canva.com, saved it as a PDF and I personally use gumroad.com to host all of my ebooks and digital products um, and now I'm actually selling physical products through there as well. Um, but I really like that platform. And like I said, it's a way that we've been able to make extra income every single month using passive income through selling eBooks. So if you're listening to this episode, take a screenshot, share it into your stories and tell me one idea that you could turn into an ebook and start generating income today. Thanks for listening to the family hustle with Angela and Adam Parker. We appreciate you guys being here. If you're listening, don't forget to take a screenshot and share it into your stories and tag us at Grassfed Mama. Also, don't forget to subscribe and leave us a review on your podcast player of choice. That helps other people find out about what we're doing, and it's the best thing you can do to help us grow the podcast. Hey, Goal Getter, are you ready to stop having to chase after people only to realize they aren't even interested in what you have to offer? You spend months trying to build rapport and get to know them, and then they never seem interested in buying. What if you could attract your ideal customer to you and have them reaching out for more information about your business and what you have to offer? If this sounds like something you want more info on how you can put into practice, join our Attraction Marketing Bootcamp, where we take five days to dig deep into discovering what your ideal customer wants and how you can be the most attractive to them through branding and developing a customer journey. Over the five days, you'll have worksheets and videos to guide you through this self-study. To learn more, head on over to grassfedmama.com slash attraction marketing. And now back to the show.